Okay, Mom. Yes, Kelsey. What do you want? Would it be alright if I went to my friend's house for a couple of hours? Of course you can. Just make sure that you be careful when crossing the road, okay? Okay, thanks, Mom. And I will see you later. I cannot wait to see Megan. I haven't seen her for a few weeks since she's been on vacation. Hello, I need the paramedics. My 10 year old daughter just got knocked down, and the person who ran her over just drove off and left her lying in the road. It's okay, Kelsey. Help is on the way. Just stay with us, please. I'm terribly sorry Mr. and Mrs. Coxon, but despite our best efforts, we couldn't save Kelsey and unfortunately, she didn't make it. No, not our sweet little Kelsey. She can't be gone. No, please? No, not our precious little baby. She was only 10 years old. Please, can't you just keep trying? There must be something you can do. I do wish that there was more that we could do, but Kelsey sustained a traumatic head injury and she was already losing brain function when she was brought in. I'm so, so sorry. No, you shouldn't be sorry. You did everything you could to save our little girl and we appreciate that. The only person who should be sorry is the bastard who knocked her down. That son of a bitch who knocked down our little girl and drove off should be the one who's sorry, and I am going to make sure of it. Don't you worry Kelsey sweetie, we will find out who did this to you and when we do, we will make sure that they pay for what they did, you will get the justice that you deserve. Yeah, we promise you sweetie, you will get justice, and so will we, we will make sure that the person who put you in this grave is locked away for a very long time. Michael Parker you are under arrest for the hit and run involving Kelsey Cookson. Do you understand? Yeah, I understand. But, okay, time to take you to jail. Mr. Parker. I hope you are aware that your reckless actions caused the tragic death of a child. Yes, your honor. And not only that, but after knocking the child down, you just drove off and left her dying in the road, you didn't even bother to stop to see if she was okay, or even call for help. Why Michael, why did you just drive off and leave a little girl lying injured in the road? I don't know, I guess, I guess I just panicked. You're a coward, you hear me you murdering bastard, a coward. I'm so glad that justice has finally been served for our little girl. Me too. Now Kelsey can finally rest in peace. Thank you, Mom and Dad for bringing the person who did this to me to justice. I love you both so much. <laughs>